Hey guys. Oh. Right here. There you go. Hey guys, it's your girl Alondria Haynes back with another video. And yes, I am looking crusty, dusty, stankin', and I look a hot mess. As you see, my hair is very stretched out. Um, this is like a very old, old braid out, turned wash and go, turned braid out again, turned twist out, turned puff. I mean, you name it. It's just everything in one. Um, and it's not washed out yet. So I decided to try a style that I've never done before, which is pretty old trend, but I'm going to go ahead and try it, which is the dry and go. And the dry and go basically is you're starting off with dry stretched hair, um, and you're using uh, putting a gel on top of your hair to kind of define your curls, and that's it. You're not adding any water, no leave-in conditioner, just straight gel. So I the gel I'm gonna choose is the Eco Styler gel, the castor oil one, the black castor oil one. And I've seen videos of this like a long time ago, so I was like, hmm, I can definitely try this. Um, this dry and go because my hair looks a hot mess right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and section my hair off. Um, but yeah, so I'm really hoping that this works because I got somewhere to be <laughs> this weekend. So I really hope this works. Now I wouldn't recommend doing this all the time because I think that this can be a little drying to your hair. But I've seen a lot of type four naturals do this. So I think this might work. We're gonna, we're gonna see. It doesn't hurt to try. So we're gonna try to do a dry and go. Hopefully I won't use all my gel because I need some more gel. So we're gonna start on this section right here. We're gonna start in this section. Let's see. Okay, so I have my first section. I don't know if I should comb my hair out or not, but I'm just gonna like finger comb it a little bit. Just so I don't be too uh too much to handle. So yeah, I'm gonna take the Eco Stella gel. I should use my wet one, but I don't know anything. I'm gonna rub it in together. I chose this one because I feel like this gel is pretty moisturizing. So I was like, I just tried to use this one. And I think this is like kind of elongates your hair too. So yeah. Okay. I'm just gonna do the shingling method still. Oh, it still defines your hair really pretty nicely. Okay. Okay, dry and go. Oh, you done tried something, eh? You done tried something. All right, girl. I see my curls, they are popping. I guess the water kind of like reactivates the the gel, the, the hair, because you know gel has water in it. Maybe that's why it curls up, but do y'all see this first definition? Do y'all see that? But do y'all see that? Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and continue the rest of my hair and put some music on and I will show you.
phone call and I had an important phone call that I had to answer. Um, so this is the results of the dry and go style. As you see, my curls are very much popping. Um, they're very much elongated as well. Um, yeah, this took a very long time. <laughs> this took me a very long time to do because, first of all, I'm applying product. This is going to bother me. I can't. I cannot deal with the dark. All this darkness. I can't. I can't. Sorry about that. that. My bathroom door was bothering me. But, um, yes. Um, it took a very long time because I am applying product on hair that's not defined. So I had to force my hair to curl up, which took me a very long time and definitely a lot of breakage. Um, first impression, um, this took a, a lot of gel. You know, I use that almost all my gel. I literally have a corner left. Like y'all saw I started off with like a whole jar. I have a corner left. So I don't know whose wash and go is gonna be doing with this, but this is good for a good Afro puff. And that's all what I use this for. But um, initially, I think this is a really cute style. It just took me a very long time to do. And yeah, I mean, it's nice. I mean, I don't know. I feel like the water inside the gel kind of reactivated my hair a lot. But it just took so much for me to like define my hair. I had to go back. Y'all saw in the video, I had to go back and like reapply gel because my hair wasn't like curling up so that's the only con i don't like about it and that my neck is like ugh. i don't like how it makes my neck feel it makes my neck feel really greasy which i don't really like but yeah so um my hooded dryer is is broke right now at the moment so i have to unfortunately air dry but since it's done on dry hair i think this is not going to take me uh long at all to dry so i'm just gonna this uh air dry my hair for the night i'm not gonna sleep with no bonnet on or nothing i'm just gonna sleep with it as it is um i might i might put my hair in a um t-shirt and just let it like wet plop or whatever but um yeah some pieces like really had a hard time defining i was like okay carols like why are you not defining don't like that but um I guess the pro is that I got a lot of like elongation. If you're looking for more elongation than definition, then this style is definitely for you. But honestly, I'd rather just like, I mean, wait till day three, day four to get the elongation and go from there. But um, yeah, so I'll see you guys what my hair looks like when my hair dries. I'm not going to say in the morning because I'm pretty sure my hair is not going to dry in the morning. Because I have, like, loads of gel in my hair. Like, it's... My hair is gelled up, honey. Like, it's probably the most gelled up it's ever been. Because I've never... I've never done this before. So, yeah. I'm just going to show you guys what my hair looks like. Front and back real fast. I'm going to shake it out real quick. You guys see those curls? Look at those curls. See those curls? Yeah, so there's that. Yep, so I will show you guys what my hair looks like um, when it dries whenever. I'm not going to say tomorrow because we don't know if it's going to dry tomorrow. morning. But I'll show you guys what my hair looks like. Oh, yeah. Take my mask off. It's not work right now, so it's not going to mask off. But and it is uh, Green Eggs and Ham Day, Dr. Seuss week. So one of my coworkers made me a shirt it's called it says sam i am on there super cute um so that's what i got on right now i got some eyeshadow trying to be cute at work and i'm on break right now that's why i'm kind of <laughs> talking fast because i just walked over here but i got my little protein shake so i'm about to drink on that but y'all we ain't here for that we talking about the hair do y'all see my hair curls are very much popping um, I really like the dry and go. It definitely dried really fast too. Like it probably like when I woke up this morning, my hair was dry. I didn't think my hair was gonna be dry this fast. So I feel like this this routine does work if you if you're in a rush, and you don't have time to do a full wash and go. You just need to have time just to throw some gel in your hair and go. 
it works. I feel like this is a great um, routine if your hair, if you it's a weekend and you just need to do your hair real fast. Like, it's cute. It's cute. Like, it looks like one of my, my, my regular wash and goes, but just a little more volume in the roots. Now, my hair is dry. <laughs> my hair is extremely dry. Like, it just feels really dry. It just feels really crunchy. It has no type of softness to it. I think when I go home today, I'm going to apply some oil to my hair just so it can like loosen up a little bit but overall my hair it looks good like the definition looks really really good it looks really good actually like i really i'm not mad about it i think when i try this again i think i'm going to use probably more like a loosey goosey type of gel like um camille, camille rose curl maker that's a really good gel to probably use this for uh, just something like probably more moisturizing gel because I thought my eco style gel would be moisturizing, but honey, it's not. It's not. So, yeah. So, that completes my video of the dry and go. I think it's pretty cute. So, just tell me what y'all think. If y'all try this, please let me know. Comment down below. Love you guys. And I'm about to chill for the rest of my break. All right, guys. Love y'all. Peace.